And welcome to the Writer's Life, a place to get the sights, sounds, smells, taste of my particular writer's life. And where you get the truth, nothing but the truth. So help me God. Where you get some skiing. Subscribe if you haven't already. Punch the like button. Uh, ski over the uh, bell for notifications so you don't miss out on one single exciting video. Okay, it's obvious what I'm doing this morning. I just want to talk real quick. Um, I read kind of an old post by Dean Wesley Smith where he was saying, like, he has trouble remembering the plots of his books, the characters, and even the titles of his old books. Once they're and, and I do, too. And, like, and I was like, wow, do I have a problem? Am I, am I like, Joe Biden it? <laughs> you know, like, um, it's not. It's because so many people just love having written. Um, you know, they dread the whole process and once it's done though, they're, they're, they love, you know, then they can relax and they can revel in what they've done and all that sort of stuff. I actually like to write. So once a book is done and it's going to press, like, I don't even think about it anymore. I can't tell you, like a lot of people like have like all their books on their shelves, you know, like this, you know, I wrote this at, at this time and, um, I, you know. I don't even have copies of all my books. Not even close. Um, I think I have maybe like 20 or 30 of my paperback copies of my books on the shelves. And that's it. Because um, once they're published, I just don't, you know, like I move on, you know. Um, it, and if I'm going to look at one of my old books, it's only because I need, you know, it's for a reference. Maybe it, someone's name or something like that. You know, someone just to give things continuity, just to, you know, I have to research the past a little bit but uh um for my series you know for my mystery series and thriller series and stuff but uh you know uh i just you know i can't wait to start the next project and actually that that can be a problem sometimes you know and i love the process and if you love the process once it's done you're just kind of like eh, you know whatever <laughs> move on to the next one you know um anyway t skiing's great today i'll take you with me for a a few seconds because my hands freezing and uh, all right let's hope let's see if I can do this without dropping my poles all that good stuff all right where are we gonna go I think I'm gonna go to the left here all right I'm gonna turn the sorry about that are you still with me you're still with me Here we go. We're gonna go on the more difficult. Take the tire. Take a little downhill. And we shall stop. Before I kill somebody. <laughs> Other skiers probably hate it when I do this, so I gotta be mindful of them. Uh, anyway, always practice safe skiing. All right, um, I shall catch you guys tomorrow, God willing. Ciao, ciao.